topic about Tony the Closer and Caesar. Yo, Tony the Closer, if you're here watching me, academics don't need you. Academics don't need envy. So if you just want to expose DJ Envy, you could do your thing. But don't come on my shit because I'm not going to give none of y'all platforms to promote what y'all got going on. Y'all are all scammers in my book. Well, every day I wake up, there's something new in the news. This time we have your boy, DJ Academics, going at it with Tony the Closer. I guess we had a situation where DJ Academics was thinking about bringing Tony the Closer on his stream to talk about the whole situation between DJ Envy and uh, Caesar Pena and the real estate scam that's been going on that he's been covering. But on second thought, DJ Academics decided to switch it up a little bit and talk shit about Tony the Closer and don't bring him on the stream. Come on, act. Don't do that, nigga. So don't go talking about look at the women. You better go look at all my charges. See, because I'm not one of them niggas. I got equal energy. I'm an equal opportunity to fuck your ass up. I got motherfuckers all over the country that ate off me. Niggas talking about something. You paid to be on a million dollars worth of game. Nigga, McDonald's paid to get ass every motherfucking day. Let me explain something to you, you stupid, no business having motherfuckers. Let me explain something to you niggas that don't know how to make your shit pop. Yeah, nigga. Let me show you how you make your shit pop. If you go look at TV every single day, you see Sprint, Verizon, Apple, McDonald's, they all do what? They promote their business. I get on a platform and I promote my business. I'm a smart businessman. You stupid ass niggas. You ain't help nobody make no motherfucking money. You ain't got no success outside of you. Fuck wrong with you, nigga. You niggas ain't on my level. Bitch ass niggas. Niggas don't deserve platforms. Livingston. <laughs> this nigga academic is gonna come out. Say all real estate niggas are scams. This nigga can't sit down and even get his shit out without breathing out. This nigga breathe out of shape. Bro, you sitting down talking on the mic, nigga. You sitting down talking on the mic, nigga, and you can't even get your words out. This nigga sitting on live talking about all this money he got and nigga, you don't own nothing. How? Now, all of this information got back to Tony the Closer and Tony the Closer has never been the type of guy that has been shy about how he feels and he pretty much says what he thinks when he thinks it and this time was no different. So he went in on DJ Academics saying, bro, you, you calling me a clout chaser? Your whole platform is built around clout chasing. Get real. Right. Clout chasing? Bro, your whole platform is built on talking about strangers you don't know. Your whole platform is built on talking about strangers. You talking about cloud chasing, cuz? You talking about cloud chasing money? You call me a scammer? Let me tell you what you're not gonna do, and I'm gonna sue you. I'm gonna make sure, see, I'm gonna make an example. You the perfect, I know you got money. See, a lot of be doing that that slander and shit and i can't do nothing about it because you broke see but you actually got money act and i'm gonna show you the consequences when you use shit because i had a whole bunch of people it, it it tore my business up man so many people stopped doing business with me already yeah man i, I got people calling me scammer all on, on twitter and all that shit i screenshot all that because i'm gonna sue you and i'm gonna punish you online now, I don't know how many people DJ Academics can get beef with at this point. Uh, I stopped counting after a while, but I mean, the list is getting longer and longer and longer. He gets at it with these little baby. He gets at it with uh, Sharp from No Jumper. Now he's Tony the Closer. I mean, the list go on and on and on, but this time, don't seem like your boy Tony the Closer is playing no games, man. He trying to take it to court now, talk about slander and all of that. But what, what is your thoughts on all of this? Do you seem like this is blown out of proportion or is it, this is just uh, purely entertainment purposes only? Put your comments below. Let's talk about it. This is Marcus at Work Media, and I'm out this bitch.